Famously, when our founders created the Constitution, Benjamin Franklin was leaving when someone stopped him and said, what, sir, have you created? And he said, a republic, if you can keep it. In the 21st century, democracy has been in retreat around the world. You see the same set of plays in all of these countries. The attempt to politicize independent institutions, the spreading of disinformation by the government, the aggrandizing of executive power and undercutting of checks and balances, the quashing of dissent, the delegitimizing of vulnerable communities, the corrupting of elections, and the inciting of violence. To defeat an authoritarian threat, we need a broad coalition of individuals and organizations who might disagree on politics and on policy, but who do agree that it's in our mutual interest to have a functioning system of government that allows us to resolve disputes peacefully and democratically. At Protect Democracy, we're focused on addressing the root causes that are creating that anti-democratic extremism. We got a technology shop that's building technologies that are being used by Democratic and Republican secretaries of state around the country to protect our electoral systems. When we want to look the voter in the eye and say that we've got your back, the system is intact, it is protected. We've got a best-in-class legal shop to strengthen democratic institutions and make sure that they hold anti-democratic actors accountable. We've got a strategic communication shop that's making sure that the American people have the information they need to self-govern. We got a legislation shop working to pass legislation that would strengthen our democratic institutions. Democracy is hard, it's frustrating, it's imperfect. And our job is to equip people to take action because if people don't take those actions, that's how democracy dies.